I am so excited to be here with Pastor Philip Batiste, ASI's new secretary treasurer. Pastor Batiste and I, we are here at ASI's 2018 International Convention. Pastor Batiste, can you tell us about your life in 60 seconds? 60 seconds, wow, that's a tall order, but I'll try. Um, I was born in Dauphin, Manitoba, Canada. Um, I grew up in Canada. I have two older brothers, Peter and David, and my dad's been a pastor in the Avenue Church for 40 years. My mom's a teacher. I went to Andrews, and I did my degrees at Andrews, undergrad, and then seminary. Then I pastored in Colorado for 10 years, and then um, I was a missionary, my wife and I, in Africa, in Kenya, where I served as the special assistant to the president for the East Central African Division in charge of ASI and leadership development, media, communications. And now I'm just happy to come back from mission service and taking up the call to be the new ASI secretary treasurer. Well, it sounds like you've had quite the interesting and fulfilling life, but we're really glad that you ended up here with us at ASI. Amen. So tell me, what is one thing you would like to do to improve ASI over this coming year? Yeah, well, you know, ASI is an awesome organization, but they say the largest room in the world is room for improvement. And I like to step into that room each and every day. And so I think one thing we can do is, and ASI is already doing it, but um, just kind of raise awareness about ASI among our younger professionals. We have so many young professionals in their 20s, 30s that um, may not have heard of ASI or don't know about ASI. And so I want to just through social media, through creative marketing, just find ways to intentionally target our young professionals and raise awareness and, and, and invite them to become a part of this awesome organization. That's such an awesome goal. And speaking as a young person myself, I think that can really be improved upon. So I'm really excited to see and hear that that is your goal for the mm -hmm. future. So tell me, what are some of your core responsibilities as secretary treasurer? Well, as secretary treasurer, obviously I serve as the secretary or executive secretary for the organization. And then I also serve as the treasurer, um, you know, providing financial oversight and so on. But then in addition to that, I'm kind of like, uh, you know, in charge of really promoting and marketing the ASI brand across the North American division. And um, one of the things that I really do is I serve as kind of the connecting bridge or liaison between the, the uh, North American division and ASI. So I'm kind of that bridge that connects, you know, the lay people, the lay led organization to the official church body because I'm a, a departmental director of the North American division, but then I work as secretary treasurer of ASI. So. Um, you know, it's, it's great to be in that role because I'm able to listen, I'm able to engage, I'm able to encourage the church to kind of listen more to the lay people and support their ideas, and I'm able to encourage the lay people to kind of work in coordination with the church. So it's a fun role to have. Well, what a great description. And let's get back to a more personal question. What is something that would surprise people to learn about you? Wow. Well, maybe something surprising would be that um, there's about 35 videos of me online, um, uh, on YouTube, on Vimeo, uh, in a series I did called Communication That Connects, helping people communicate with clarity, with creativity, and for change and lasting impact. And so in that series, I have tips and resources for ministry and for leaders and for communication. So I have tips for writing sermons, tips for giving Bible studies, tips for leading prayer meeting, tips for hospital visitations, um, tips for you know how to be a more visitor-friendly church, um, you know strategies for leadership excellence, uh, tips for conflict resolution, um, uh, you know how to resolve a conflict, how to mediate a conflict, um, you know using like the clear approach, calm, listen, empathize, apologize, remedy. Like when someone is mad at you, um, tips for writing emails, just a bunch of resources, and so. Um, I'm excited about that because I think that it uh, should be all of our goals to just help uh, encourage one another and, and use the gifts we have to be a blessing to others. That's excellent. And who doesn't want to learn how to communicate better? Mm -hmm. So final words, 
What would you like to say to our viewing audience? I'd like to say, you know, get involved in total member involvement. You're not just coming to church to, you know, sit on the pew and have a good show Sabbath morning. God is calling each one of us to get involved, to use our gifts and talents for him. So ask him, how can I be a better witness? How can I use the gifts you've given me to reach other people with the good news of Jesus Christ? So that would be my final encouragement to everyone. Get involved, you know, make a difference for him. Amen. Well, Pastor Batiste, thank you so much for taking the time to sit down and talk about your position and a little bit about your life. And we appreciate so much that you're here working with us at ASI. We look forward to what you do in the future. Awesome. Thank you so much. It's been a pleasure and keep praying for me and I'll be praying for you.